What's up guys and gals? Um, so this week I'm going to be catching up on the two subjects that I'm a little behind on. And because for personal reasons I can't do this week's subject, that's part of the reason why I decided to do it this week. So the two that I'm missing is favorite actor or actresses. And uh, I'm going to have to figure that one out, I'm not quite sure. And the other one is partners and family. So this video is going to be about partners and family. So, to simply say, as for the partner part, I guess this kind of sounds interesting, but either way, um, it's complicated for me, and that's all I'm going to say, and I'm going to end the partner aspect of that. Um, I guess technically you could say I'm single, but yeah, four words on to that. <laughs> family. So, my family, I wouldn't be here without them, all uh, certain people. Um, it's definitely been a rocky road with my transition, but it's been a good road, I guess you can say. I've been able to teach my family certain things that they didn't know before that actually can help them. So, what I'm going to start out with is my parents. I'm going to do an each individual as it's for coming out, and I'll warn you, it's going to be over six minutes. I know we're supposed to go to, like, five minutes, but for me, I talk a lot. <laughs> so, as for my mother, she's probably been one of the main people who've grounded me throughout my lifetime. Uh, the person who's kept me going, the reason why I'm still here. Um, basically, she's one of the main people who mean the most to me in my life. Um, so, as for my mother... When I first came out to her, I came out as bi. Um, yeah, and yes, by the way, I am one of the trans guys. And I'll explain to you why I do trans guys and why I say certain things in a certain way. Hopefully, there will be a subject or another free subject topic where I can talk about why I say certain things in a certain way about my gender and whatnot and about with me being trans. Um, but going on. <laughs> so, for my mother... I first came out as bi, and I remember the day oh so clearly. I remember where I sat and where I told her, and um, she was very accepting. So I was really happy about that. Um, through the years after coming out originally as bisexual, my sexuality changed. Um, I don't think that it actually ever changed. It's just more so I realized who I truth really was, and I felt like my sexuality wasn't, like, I'm not one for labels. Um, but I use labels because of how society feels that we need to use them. And, uh, it can help in ways. So just remember when I say about my sexuality and whatnot, it's society's benefactor, I guess you can say. Um, but when I came out to my mom, I came out as bisexual, and like I said, my, uh, sexuality has evolved. I guess that would be the word for it. Um, my mother's been accepting since day one as I came out to her. It was definitely a struggle for me, but it was okay. Um, when I came out to my mother as trans, that was a hard thing for me. I remember it was a Jewish holiday, yes, I think, like, almost all my stories with my mother happens on Jewish holidays, why, I have no clue. Um, we were talking about something else, and I, I think I was having a lot of guilt, and I brought my mother into a separate room and told her, and she pretty much seemed like she was accepting of it, and through time, I found out she thought I was a potentially thought I was a butch lesbian in denial, which was never a possibility. It didn't take her until me starting hormones for her to truly accept me being trans. So that was not easy, but I understood, and definitely having the reality of not, like, it's going to take time for my mother and my family to accept me for who I am was a big benefactor and really has gotten me farther with my family uh, if I didn't have that in my mind. So, my mom's, at to this date, very accepting and whatnot. My father, I had, my sexuality, I'm not out at all with him about that, and I prefer not to be, for personal reasons. Me and my father, to simply say, does not have a good relationship. Um, as for my coming out as trans, um, he does not, he does know he's in denial. Um, the reason why I had to tell my father, I didn't want to honestly tell him, I didn't want to have to come out to him, but the difference with me coming out as trans to my father was because I had to. I was going to be starting hormones, and I'm almost two years on T, 
and the changes would have been obvious. So I couldn't just keep on going with my life and him seeing these changes, changes and wonder what the hell is going on. I mean, yes, I was over 18 where I could legally get testosterone, but it just wasn't right. Um, so my mother told him because I was scared to tell him. That's a simple basis of him. Um, I have two older sisters. I'm not going to go into my extended family. Um, my oldest sister, in the beginning, wasn't as accepting with my sexuality, then became more accepting and wanting to learn, and it's been quite interesting, to say the least, but, uh, siblings aren't always going to be that way, at least with me it will always be that way. Um, as for coming out as trans, that was a rough road at first with her, as it was with a lot of my family. Now she's amazingly accepting, a lot more something than I ever thought she would be, so that makes me very, very happy. Um, that's the, to say the least about my oldest sister, and the most. Her husband's amazing, my nephews, and my niece is amazing as well, even though she's too young to call me by the right pronouns, as a right name. Um, my middle sister, she's married as well. Her and her husband are very accepting of me, but I'm not really close with her, um, so there's not really a point to go in detail about that. But that's the basis of my family. Most of them are really accepting of me and are really there for me when I really need them. And I've been very lucky, um, not only with coming out with my sexuality and them accepting me for who I am, but also coming out as trans and them accepting me for who I am. So I'll see you guys really soon um, with the video about my favorite actress slash actor-ishness. Um, <laughs> I'm not quite sure yet what I'm going to do. Bye, guys.